Hello and welcome back everyone. So today I thought I would show you something uh, quite boring, but maybe it will be interesting to some of you. So, bandaging. Okay. If you need to bandage something and then you need to attach your bandage in the end, your gauze roll, how do you do it? Well, you can use tape, safety pins, you know, some come with Velcro now, you know, to attach them with. But there is a very simple way to do this, which I don't see people do anymore, at least here on YouTube. Um, which people, which was the, you know, the regular method back when. So I will just show you quickly here and then maybe we can talk about it a little bit more. So if you're going to bandage, you know, you of course put on your dressing, wound dressing, and then you bandage it up with your gauze to keep the dirt away from the bandage. You, you never you never just put a wound dressing and then tape it in place. That is not very uh, very good. You want to you want to bandage it first, okay? So here we come to the end. Of course you can just tuck it. If you have elastic gauze you can tuck it, which works quite quite well. If you have non-elastic gauze Okay, or you're using a cravat or something like that, or an older type of gauze bandage, you will not have the elasticity. So, what you do? Well, you can tape it in place, or you can simply do what they always did before. You cut it down the middle. Okay. So now you have two pieces of gauze, and then you simply... Tie it off. Okay. A very simple way to attach a gauze bandage. And you don't need tape, you don't need anything, you just need your rolled gauze. So maybe some of you found this useful, maybe not. Maybe this is known to all of you, maybe none of you. So yeah, just a quick tip from the prepared Norseman. I hope you all have a great day. Bye bye.